When people ask what I do, I tell them I'm an accountant. I'm actually an auditor, but that word scares them, I think. You know? The count has this image of, of being these people that sit in a chair, you know, and they punch numbers and, and they wear glasses. <laughs> That's the fucking joke right there, you know? The counts used to wear white shirts and they wore hats. Right, nowadays they've got Rolexes and Versace and all this bling bling shit. Okay? I work for a business. It's an organization. And, and these people, they hire me to do their work. And, and, you know, I need to find out, okay? If people are stealing money, you know, I don't care if they steal money. I want to know about it, all right? <laughs> yeah, I definitely want to know about it. So what I do is I'm brought in, and, you know, I have customer X who says he makes, let's just say, Z amount of money each year. You know, and I'm brought in and I look at his books to make everything running legitly smooth. Now, I sit him down and I like to do this on a spot check basis. You know, surprise him, throw him off a little bit. And I sit him down and I ask him, you know, what do you do? How do you do it? You know, where are you getting the money to run this operation? All right, you know, because these people, they can be a little shifty. So anyway, I sit these people down, we talk for a while, and you know, you think this guy's, you think this guy's happy? Can you blame him? I mean, he's not too fucking happy now, you know, talking to me. But I can't blame him. Anyway. Oh, just... okay. I cannot blame him. So anyway, I sit him down, we talk, and I want to make sure this is the deal. Okay? Are things legit? Okay? You say you make this amount of money. The books say this. You say that. Does everything add up? That's the most important thing. So we sit down and we talk, and I want to get some answers, okay? It's very important that we find out that everything's going, that everything run, is, is running smoothly. Smooth. And, uh, you know, I don't... I don't have the authority Someone has to make decisions. Sometimes someone has to say something, all right? It's not my decision, but God damn it, I'm there to provide the fucking answers. <laughs> Sometimes I think to myself, am I going to be alive in this business? What? It's not like these people are waving guns at me, all right? Christ, you know, we otters, we like to have fun too. You know, we like to go out, we like to have drinks. Like gentlemen, we like to enjoy ourselves. We like to kick back. It's not, it's not, you know, we don't talk about work off the job. No. But there's always that one asshole who has to say something, you know? And do you think I hate my job? I love my job, you know? We're in it for the money. So when people ask me, you know, do, do, you, do you think your job's important? And I find myself asking that a lot. Do I find myself, what I do, important? The investors think so. Yeah. It's a business. It's nothing personal. decided to expel Dexter from the entire public school system. Oh, Mr. Kirk, I'm as upset as you to learn Dexter's two and three, but surely expulsion is not the answer. I'm afraid expulsion is the only answer. It is the opinion of the entire staff that Dexter is criminally insane. Same, same, same. That boy needs therapy. Psychosomatic. That boy needs therapy. Psychosomatic. That boy needs therapy. Lie down on the couch. Well, what does that mean? You're a nut. You're crazy in the coconut. What does that mean? That boy needs therapy. I'm gonna kill you.